Right now, we want to warm up our bodies, and we want to start learning tennis movements while we do it. Right now, you'll see 10 cones on the court. I need three of you to step up over here to the double valley on the ad side. I need three of you to step up to the singles alley, I mean the doubles alley on the deuce side. So you're coming over here, three of you step up. This is a three on three competition. You three, your job is knocking down cones. Your job for the next 30 seconds is standing up cones. Standing up cones. You guys understand? Knock them down, stand them up. Obviously, they're already stood up, so you can't stand any up, so they knock them up. But here's how I want you to move. I want you to move with your eyes up, your knees bent, and your backside think out or up, okay? So we move, we want to move like this. If you saw on your lesson plan, a picture of a woman on there who is one of the greatest professional tennis players of all time. Does anybody know who it was? Serena Williams. You'll notice that she is in this stance right here. So this is part of our ready position. We're gonna work on our shuffle step as we move. So if you want to go for that cone, I actually don't want you to take off running straight forward. I want you to shuffle step like this, feet together, knock it over. Shuffle step, feet together, knock it over. Shuffle step, if you're the one picking it up, pick it up, shuffle step, stay low, work on those quads, pick it up. How does that sound? Does that sound difficult? Okay, you're not running forward. You might want to go ahead and turn to the side. Do not collide with each other. And you now have 30 seconds. At the end of 30 seconds, we're gonna see who has the most up. And go. Good, good. Remember, eyes up. Try and keep eyes up. Yep. We don't want to just leave it over. Yeah, good. 20 seconds to go. Good, 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 good. Excellent, excellent. Give me a quick count. Who won? The knocker downers or the picker uppers? All right. Definitely the knocker downers. All right. We're going to start that way. You ladies clear to the side. My other six, please join us. You guys are knocker downers. You guys are picker uppers. Remember what we're looking for as we're warming up this lower body? Great. We're looking for Serena Williams' great ready stance. This is actually her return to serve stance. We're looking for that. We're looking for eyes up, not leaned over like this. Eyes up. Backside popped or back just a little bit so that you're really engaging these women. We're moving to the side. You got it? Your picker uppers, your knocker downers. And I'll help give you guys something too. And you now have 30 seconds. As soon as I get that stopwatch ready, and go. And we're moving to the side. Now move forward. Good. Good. Good side movement. Good. I like how far you're now. Get the hell out of here. Good. 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 Come on, picker uppers. Come on, picker uppers. Get away. Move, move. Yeah. Nice job. Nice job, ladies. All right. Two more seconds to go. Good, good, good. Shuffle step to the side. Good. We're not rolling our feet over. Two more seconds. One more second. Stop. Good job. All right. Let's see. All right. Who won on that one? Knocker downers just barely had an advantage on that one. Next, you ladies take a rest. The other six step back up with your rackets. Grab your racket. Now we're learning a little bit more tennis movement. Hopefully your heart rate is a little elevated. It's about to get more so. And so, can I borrow your racket real quick? Because I put mine over there in the ballpark. 91 beats per minute. 91 beats per minute, good. We're at Elevate, 90 is a great target to shoot for. 90 to 110, I think, and we're doing great. Now you're doing the same thing, but you only have one hand to knock down and pick up with, your left hand, since all of you are right handed. All right, we move with our racket while we shuffle. Please do not use this as a bludgeon to draw blood. Just a second, we'll get to your questions. What I want, the tip of the racket, Below the eyes, the head of the racket, above your hand. That means while you shuffle step, we don't want the racket to go down here. Does that make sense? While you shuffle step and knock them over, it stays below your eyes, and while you pick them up, it stays above the hand. Does that make sense? Do you have any questions? Oh, okay. I like this. So, you guys are now the knocker over, right? Isn't that what you wanted? Yeah. Yes. 
You ladies are now the picker-uppers. Picker-uppers, don't you like our technical tennis terms? Knocker-downers, picker-uppers. Ready, reset, and go. Help me get these to the middle real quick. <laughs> All right, our next group, step up. Great. Next group, step up, and let's go ahead. You guys are knocker downers. You guys are picker uppers. Got it? Does that work for you? Good. And I'm already picking up the ones close to you. All right. Ladies, remember our goals are to engage those quads to get a good athletic stance to have our eyes up, our rackets up, not dipping down, our rackets up while we shuffle step. And ladies, you are almost ready to go. Stop, three set, now, go. 30 seconds, hopefully your heart rate's up. Oh, that one didn't fall over. Good, good, shuffle, shuffle. Eyes are up, eyes are up, hands up. So we're not bending over fully at the waist. We're squatting with the leg. Strong legs, strong limits, good shuffle, good shuffle. Nobody's running, good shuffle. Great, here we go, 10 more seconds. All right, put that extra bird's feet on. Get that extra one up. Here we go, one more, stop. <laughs> okay, hey, great job, ladies. If you need a drink, grab a drink after you pick up the cones and any of the bowls that are laying around. Thank you, ladies, for warming up with me and learning some tennis movements.